All right, and we're back. It is Thursday. I don't know what the date is anymore, but it's a tertiary squat day. It's been a weird day in Fresno today because as you can see, it's overcast as hell and it was just pissing rain for like 10 minutes. So it felt like I was back in Florida like last summer. Brody, Billy and Garner, if you watch this video, I miss you guys. Florida was a great time. I miss Florida. Texas, Florida, probably a state I would like to move to in the future just because that's my time. Anyway, we got tertiary squat day. We just have high bar three by eight. I think at a prescribed weight. I don't remember what it is. I haven't done high bar in about a year. Like I basically started powerlifting about a little bit over a year ago and I haven't high barred since, so it's gonna be kind of fun. So yeah, I'll see you guys at this one. And we're done with squat and my accessories actually. So I just had a three by eight uh, high bar squat. I haven't, like I said, I haven't done high bar since last August and it is August, so it's been about a year. And uh, yeah, those felt all right. It's just, it wasn't the most high high bar. It's kind of like more of a higher mid bar hybrid type thing just because everything above that hurts because I have like a quote unquote lower low bar. So that's what I'm used to. And I just, like I said, I haven't done it in a year, so it kind of hurt, but it's all right. Felt good, I got a really nice quad pump from that. I was supposed to be prescribed just two reds, but I kind of went above two reds, sorry Lucas. So I did my first set at two reds, second set at two and a white, so that's 287. And my last set I did, I kind of overshot it. it was, I just did 140 kg, which is 309 pounds. I didn't post that one on my Instagram just because I didn't like the way that set looked, but I'll just post it here in the video. But yeah, that's high bar. Then I just had some heavy leg press, I did that for three sets of 10. And then some dumbbell RDLs, I just did 90s for a three by 12. And then the dead bugs and planks, finished all those. And yeah, we're done with Thursday. So I'll see you guys in tomorrow's session. All right, we're back. It is Friday. We just have some sad bench day. I think we have Spoto Larson three by five, three by six, something like that. Prescribed weight, nothing crazy. Just that and then some chest accessories. And then we're done for the day. It's a very chill day. Then we have a SPD tomorrow with tempo squat, three count bench, and then regular comp deads for a set of, I don't even know. Well, it's kind of exciting because we got a new bar for the gym. Mike got us a black KG Ohio power bar. So that thing's nice. So we're going to try and keep it from all the weird that are at the gym so they don't mess up our bar. So yeah, but yeah, I'll see you guys at the bench.
to have fun, no, no, no. To get back, no, no, no. They don't want you, they want this. I ain't trying to play your game, no. Making with my dream, no, no. We not gonna take no more. But you know you can't do it, so no. Yeah, I remember the days when I used to adore you. Hey, guys. <laughs> We're done with bench, just had a 3x5 Spoto Larson bench, that's it. Just did 80 kg for all that with that prescribed weight. Felt nice, felt good, like I said, just doing anything we can to get bench up. Did my accessories, had incline dumbbell bench, had 3x15, just did 50 pounds for all three sets. Then we just had face pulls and then for my bicep and tricep of choice, I just did overhead with an easy bar and then right into bicep curls with that. And yeah, that is it for this session. So I got SBD tomorrow. These new pug slippers are f***ing amazing. These virus tats are nice. So yeah, I'll see you guys in tomorrow's session. All right, and we're back. It is Saturday. It is SBD Saturday. So I'm not going to walk around inside, outside and film this because it is way too hot today. So yeah, we just have tempo squat, 3-1-0 tempo at 3x5 at an RP6, and then 3 count bench, 3x4, 3x3 at an RP6, and then 3x5 competition deadlift at an RP6, and then just some accessories today, and then we're done for the week. It's been a pretty chill training week, but yeah, we just have top triples this block, and then next block we're gonna have singles again, so hopefully we can get to back around where I was in my peak for the meet, and then build from there. So hopefully we can build a bigger total in the upcoming months, and then maybe qualify for collegiate nationals next year. Who knows? <laughs> film each uh, little recap after each lift. I'm just gonna do it all once right here, but I'm gonna splice it up in the video just for video sake. So for squat, we just had a three x five at an RP6 of a 310 tempo. Those felt really nice. I'm just using my stoic sleeves now on my secondary and tertiary squat days just to keep myself honest for what I build tolerance for my heavy singles and my heavy triples. So I'm just gonna use my insert sleeves on my primary days now and then my stoics on my secondary and tertiary days. I just did 140 kg for all three sets. Those felt really nice. Tempos had me gassed and dying, but tempo was honestly kind of fun. a three count competition bench, three by three at an RP six to seven. I did 90 kg for my first two sets, those felt really nice. And then I did 95 kg for my last set. Bench is feeling really nice. 
I get to bench on a fat pad for a little bit, so uh, I'm gonna make use of that because the fat pad is fun. We just had a 3x5 competition deadlift at uh, RP6. I did 200 kg for my first set. That moved really nice. It felt heavy as shit, but it just moved very fast. That new black kg bar is very stiff. I forgot how stiff those are, but I like it better than the stainless steel. I did 190 kg for my second set. Filmed the side angle for that. In my last set, I just sandbagged and did 170 kg or three reds. Now I just have kettlebell lateral raises and seal rows, and then we're done for the day. So that is it for this training session. I'll see you guys in the next one.